name is Dr. Kale White, and I'm the Associate Director of Critical Path Institute's Critical Path to Therapeutics for the Ataxias Consortium, or CPTA for short. Hereditary ataxias are heterogeneous, rare neurological diseases characterized by progressive symptoms, including uncoordinated movements and speech. My academic background is in neurobiology and neuroeconomics, and my previous research focused on how and where in the brain risk and uncertainty are evaluated, and then how the brain drives behaviors to reduce this uncertainty going forward. Before my current role as Associate Director, I also served as CPATH's Chief of Staff and completed a postdoctoral fellowship in regulatory science. The CPTA Consortium launched in February of this year and is the newest public-private partnership at CPATH. At CPTA, we aim to optimize clinical trials within the inherited ataxias and catalyze medical product development in this space. We do this by bringing together experts from across the ataxia field from diverse backgrounds, including patient advocacy, academic and clinical ataxia research, regulatory science, and development. CPTA serves as a neutral, pre-competitive platform where folks from across these broad stakeholder groups can come together in order to determine consensus on what constitute the largest barriers to development and approval of new therapies for the ataxias. Once these barriers have been identified, members of CPTA can work together to advance and approve innovative solutions to, come, to overcome these barriers. For example, CPTA's plans include aggregating the necessary data across different disease data sets to inform our community's understanding of the natural histories of the different ataxias, and to support the development and approval of new disease-relevant measures within this space. We're currently analyzing existing and new biomarkers and endpoints that can be used to measure disease progression and potential effectiveness and safety of new therapies in clinical trials for the ataxias. Thereafter, we can work towards the regulatory acceptance of these measures to decrease both the time and the cost for the development of new therapies for ataxia patients. As the Associate Director of CPTA, I work with CPATH and external leadership to generate and implement the strategic plan of this consortium and to prioritize its goals. This includes working with all stakeholders within this space to identify areas of the greatest unmet need, determine and prioritize strategies to develop regulatory solutions to address these needs, and to help position developers to translate these solutions into the approval of novel therapies as effectively as possible. As Associate Director, I work within a wonderful team of project coordinators, project managers, and other scientists to achieve this goal. What excites me most about my work as Associate Director is getting to be a part of the vibrant and dedicated ataxia community. CPTA exists at the crossroads of cutting-edge biological science, innovative regulatory science, and amazing patient advocates, and it builds upon the incredible work that's been done already to improve the lives of ataxia patients. I'm sincerely thankful to have been welcomed into this community and to have the unique opportunity to serve people living with ataxia as Associate Director of CPTA.